What is going on, everybody? My name is Fluffy Ninja, and welcome back to Modern Warfare 2 Season 4. And we've got a new bundle. The Reactive Pack, Soulless. This looks fucking dope. So it comes with a Spectral Ghost Skin for Ghost. Let's take a look at him. Bro, guarding the balls. I like it. That is really cool looking, actually. That is fucking dope. All right, like, I'm a big fat guy, okay? I know that. How the fuck is he going to reach these knives? How? Like, how? Bro, how are you going to pull those out successfully? Reaching, oh, those are too low to reach over. Like, how the fuck, like, he is fucking jacked, yoked. How the fuck is he going to grab those knives? <laughs> but the skin does look really cool. Oh, let's see. We get the Tempest Razorback called Absolution. Let's look, yeah, let's look at these tracers. Oh, that's cool. It's like you collect their soul. That is so dope. That's cool. That's really, really cool. And we get to test it out here in the fire range. Oh, wow. It was like, it, like the glow went down the weapon. That was pretty cool. What the fuck? That's awesome. And there's like a noise that goes with it. That's really cool. That's really, really cool. Yeah, that was fucking dope. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. Comes with the 17 uh, IOXL barrel. Comes with the Saken Tread 40, the FTAC Ripper grip, the high velocity ammo, and the 45 round mag. That is really, really cool. It's a great build, too. It's very, very steady. Like, it wasn't moving that much at all. Uh, also comes with the Lockman Sub, or the MP5, called the Mercy. Let's go ahead and test it out. Well, not enough to hit that last guy. They look, they look phenomenal. They really, really do. Take a closer look. Got the FT Mobile stock, the one milliwatt laser, the FTEC uh, sub 12 inch barrel, the FSS covert muzzle, and the Lockman TCG rear grip. The bro, the like the the Razorback looked good. The MP5 just, I mean, the MP5 always looks good. Let's be honest. Like just the yeah. Uh, also comes with a new combat knife called the Deliverance. Actually, can you even test this in the firing range? Oh my god, you can. I mean, there's the inspection for it. I don't know why I laid down that finger the shit out of the keys. I mean, it looks cool. Uh, equipment skin delivered. Oh, so this is for the, uh, the throwing knife. So you get a new, uh, skin for the throwing knife. You get the weapon charm spirit lantern. 
again, what the fuck? You have a skull hanging off of this. Why don't you make that the weapon charm? Spirit Lantern doesn't make any fucking sense. Uh, the Harvested weapon sticker. The Ghost Needs Souls loading screen. And the Two's a Crowd animated emblem. I don't know what that means. I mean, I know what Two's a Crowd means, but I don't know how it pertains to this, this emblem. That makes no sense. For 2,800 COD points... I can see it. I'm glad they only added 400 COD points for the knife. Uh, you know, the the knife skin and then the throwing knife skin. I, I can see why they added that because you technically that's a different thing they have to load in. But yeah, for 2,800 COD points, honestly, that's not bad. And again, like the fact that we get to kind of test it in the firing range is pretty sick. Especially because, like, I'm not going to buy it. But, you know, if this is something that you're interested, absolutely. I would say, you know, you're a grown person. You can do whatever the fuck you want with your money. It's completely up to you. The the fucking operator skin looks dope as shit. And the, the weapons are really, really good. But, yeah, that's all I've got for you today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Later.